Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's top 10 castles from the United Kingdom. From majestic fortresses to royal residences, each of these remarkable structures holds centuries of stories, battles and legends. Join me, Ben James from 7 Vlogs, as we step back in time to discover these iconic British castles. At number 10 on our list stands the iconic Tower of London, a historic fortress that has witnessed over a thousand years of history. Situated along the banks of the River Thames, this formidable structure has served various roles throughout its existence. Initially built as a royal residence, the tower later transformed into a symbol of power, defence and imprisonment. Its distinctive white tower constructed in the 11th century, stands tall as a testament to the Norman conquest of England. As we explore the complex, we encounter the infamous Bloody Tower, where the mysterious disappearance of the princes in the tower occurred during the 15th century. The Crown Jewels are another awe-inspiring attraction, offering a glimpse into British royalty. Throughout its history, the Tower of London has also played a vital role as a fortress, defending the capital from numerous threats. Its storied past includes a myriad of battles, executions and even ghostly legends, making it one of the most haunted sites in our country. At number 9, we find the majestic Stirling Castle. Perched high on a volcanic rock and offering breathtaking views of the surrounding landscape, this historic fortress has played a crucial role in shaping Scotland's history and was once a favoured residence for Scottish monarchs. Dating back to the 12th century, Stirling Castle boasts an impressive architectural style, blending both medieval and renaissance elements. The Great Hall, with its elaborate decorations and wooden hammer beam roof, stands as a testament to the castle's opulence during its golden age. This castle's gardens and courtyards provide serene spots to take in the beauty of the surroundings and imagine life in ancient times. The castle's strategic location has made it the focal point of several significant battles. Most notably, the Battle of Stirling Bridge in 1297, where William Wallace achieved a momentous victory against the English. Its historical significance continued during the Wars of Independence and beyond, solidifying its place in Scotland's storied past. At number 8, we have the enchanting Alnwick Castle, a true gem nestled in the picturesque Northumberland countryside. This medieval fortress holds the distinction of being the second largest inhibited castle in England, and it's brimming with history and charm. Dating back to the 11th century, Alnwick Castle has been the ancestral home of the Percy family, who of course are the Dukes of Northumberland for over 700 years. As you step inside, you are transported to a world of knights and nobles, with grand halls, furnishings and stunning artwork that reflect the castle's rich heritage. Olmwick Castle is famous for its association with the Wizarding World, as it served as the filming location for parts of the Harry Potter film series. Harry Potter fans can explore the locations used for iconic scenes, such as the courtyard where Harry learned to fly on his broomstick, and the grounds of Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. In addition to its film connections, Ormick Castle offers a range of activities and experiences for visitors of all ages, from archery and medieval crafts to stunning gardens and thrilling falconry displays. There is something for everyone at this castle. At number seven, we have the magnificent Dover Castle, perched atop the iconic white cliffs overlooking the English Channel. This imposing fortress has stood as the guardian of the English coast for over nine centuries, with a history that spans from Roman times all the way to the Cold War. Dover Castle's strategic location 
made it a vital stronghold throughout history, protecting the nation from potential invaders, and it provided a safe haven for royalty during times of conflict. Its well-preserved medieval walls and towers tell tales of sieges, battles and siege works that have shaped the course of British history. One of the highlights of a visit to Dover Castle is the Great Tower, a striking structure that dates back to the reign of Henry II. Inside, you can explore the grandeur of royal apartments and marvel at the displays showcasing the castle's military past. Dover Castle's combination of history, natural beauty and panoramic views make it a must destination for any history enthusiast or architectural admirer, and anyone seeking to immerse themselves in the rich heritage of the United Kingdom, prepare to be captivated by the tales of battles and bravery that echo within its walls. At number six, we have the majestic Carnarvon Castle. This is a true gem of North Wales. This grand medieval fortress is steeped in history and stands as a symbol of Welsh power and resilience. Built by King Edward I in the late 13th century, Carnarvon Castle was strategically located to maintain control over the region and to assert English dominance. The castle's distinctive polygonal towers and imposing walls make it an architectural marvel of its time. Its construction was carefully planned to showcase the might of the English crown, where incorporating elements of Welsh culture and tradition, including the use of local stone in its construction. Carnarvon Castle's most famous feature is its Grand King's Gate, adorned with intricately carved stone figures. This gatehouse, along with the castle's well-preserved interior, has earned it a, a UNESCO World Heritage Site status. The castle's location along the stunning coast of North Wales adds to its allure, with breathtaking views of the Menai Strait and the surrounding Snowdonia National Park. A visit to Carnarvon Castle is an unforgettable journey through time, allowing visitors to immerse themselves in the history, culture and beauty of this exceptional Welsh landmark. Staying in Wales now, we have the magnificent Conwy Castle at number five. This imposing fo fortress is located in the town of Conwy, nestled along the picturesque North Welsh coast. Again, built by Edward I between 12, 1283 and 1289, Conwy Castle was strategically positioned to control the key crossing point of the River Conwy and to suppress any potential Welsh uprisings. The castle's construction was part of King Edward's ambitious ring of castles in North Wales, which was meant to exert English control over the region. Conwy Castle's striking appearance with its eight massive towers and formidable walls is an awe-inspiring sight that never fails to capture the imagination of any visitor. The castle's design incorporated the latest military and innovations of its time, such as concentrate walls and a water-filled moat, making it virtually impenetrable. One of the most remarkable features of Conwy Castle is its Great Hall, a grand chamber that served as the centrepiece of the castle's domestic life. The Great Hall was lavishly decorated and played host to numerous feasts and celebrations during the castle's heyday. Visitors to Conway Castle can explore its towers, walk along its walls and enjoy breathtaking views of the surrounding landscape. The castle's historical significance, coupled with its stunning location, make it a must-visit de destination for anyone seeking to delve into the rich history and beauty of Wales. At number four, we have the splendid Arundel Castle, a true gem nestled in the heart of the West Sussex countryside. This stunning castle is a perfect blend of history, architecture and breathtaking scenery. Arundel Castle dates back almost a thousand years, with its origins tracing to the Norman era. It was originally built by Roger de Montgomery in the 11th century and later came into the possession of the powerful Fitzalan family who became the Dukes of Norfolk. 
But what makes Arundel Castle truly unique is its seamless blend of medieval and Victorian architecture. While the castle's core structure retains its medieval roots, it underwent an extensive renovation in the 19th century under the direction of the 15th Duke of Norfolk, transforming it into the grand and picturesque castle we see today. Visitors to Arundel Castle can immerse themselves in the grandeur of its medieval and Victorian heritage, meander through the lush gardens and enjoy special events and exhibitions held within its walls. The castle's timeless beauty and historical significance make it a must-visit destination for any history enthusiast or anyone seeking a glimpse into England's rich heritage. Number three takes us to Warwick Castle, a grand fortress located in Warwickshire, England. This castle boasts a history spanning over a thousand years and has witnessed countless historical events making it a true icon of England's medieval heritage. Originally built by William the Conqueror in 1068, Warwick Castle has seen numerous transformations through the centuries. Its strategic location along the River Avon made it a vital stronghold during the Middle Ages. Over time, various noble families, including the de Beauchamp and Greville families, have owned and expanded the castle, leaving behind an impressive architectural tapestry. Stepping inside Warwick Castle is like travelling back in time, from its imposing walls and towers to the impressive great hall and state rooms. Visitors are immersed in the castle's rich history. One of the highlights is the 14th century Caesar's Tower, which offers panoramic views of the surrounding countryside and River Avon. A trip to Warwick Castle is a journey through centuries of history, offering a glimpse into the lives of knights, royalty and nobility of the past. Whether you're captivated by its medieval allure or charmed by the scenic grounds, Warwick Castle promises an unforgettable story for anyone who ventures within its walls. At number two, we have the world-renowned Windsor Castle, a true jewel in the crown of British heritage. Located in the picturesque town of Windsor, just west of London, this magnificent castle is the oldest and largest occupied castle in the world, and it served as an official residence of her late majesty the Queen. With history dating back over 900 years, Windsor Castle has played a pivotal role in British history and has witnessed numerous royal weddings, state banquets and historic events. Again, it was built by William the Conqueror in the 11th century, but since then has, it has undergone expansions and renovations by various monarchs. Stepping inside Windsor Castle is like taking a step back in time. The state apartments adorned with exquisite artworks by renowned artists are a testament to the opulence of the British monarchy. The iconic St George's Chapel is an outstanding example of Gothic architecture, as it serves as the final resting places for many British monarchs. Windsor Castle's enduring significance as a royal residence and cultural landmark is further underscored by its inclusion on the UNESCO World Heritage List. And finally, taking the top spot today is Edinburgh Castle. Perched atop an ancient volcanic rock, this iconic fortress dominates the skyline of Edinburgh and stands as a symbol of Scottish history and national pride. With a history dating back over a thousand years, Edinburgh Castle has witnessed countless battles, royal ceremonies and monumentous events that have shaped the course of Scottish history. From its early days as a medieval stronghold to its role as a royal residency and military barracks. This the castle story past is etched into every stone. As you approach the castle, you can't help but be in awe of its imposing presence. The stunning views of Edinburgh from the castle's ramparts are simply breathtaking, making it one of the most ph photographed landmarks in the world. Inside the castle walls, Visitors can explore the historic crown jewels of Scotland, including the dazzling crown, sceptre and sword of state, as well as the Stone of Destiny, used in the coronation of Scottish and British monarchs for centuries. St Margaret's Chapel is the oldest surviving building in Edinburgh, 
and it offers a glimpse into the castle's early history and is a ser serene space for contemplation. The Great Hall, with its intricate ceiling and impressive collection of weaponry, takes you back to the days of medieval and royal feasts. The one o'clock gun, fired daily from the castle's ramparts, is a time-honoured tradition that dates back to the 19th century, when it served as a time signal for ships in the nearby port of Leith. Beyond its historical significance, Edinburgh Castle also plays host to the world-famous Edinburgh Military Tattoo, an annual extravaganza of music, dance and precision, marching performed by military bands from around the world, and set against the stunning backdrop of the castle. Visiting Edinburgh Castle is a truly unforgettable experience, immersing you in a rich tapestry of Scottish history and culture, as you walk in the footsteps of kings, queens and soldiers, you can't help but be captivated by the sense of heritage and pride that envelops this extraordinary fortress. So there you have it. There's your top 10 most beautiful castles in the UK, each with its own unique charm, history and allure. From Windsor Castle to the beauty of Carnarvon, these architectural marvels stand as a testament to the enduring legacy of the British Isles. Whether you're a history enthusiast or a cultural explorer, or simply a lover of breathtaking landscapes. A visit to these castles promises an unforgettable journey through time and heritage. Well, there you have it, guys. Ben James bringing you the top 10 castles. Until next time, see you soon.